So it's in real terms, it's actually quite difficult to understand why new nuclear. I mean, one of the explanations is uh, people have just woken up to climate change. You know, oh gosh, climate change is here. Whereas you know, people like me and other people have been shouting about this for 30, 40 years. And there's this idea of, oh, I know what we can we can uh, resolve all our climate problems with nuclear. Unfortunately. Uh, nuclear uh, will be one of the most uh, significant climate casualties. Nuclear is based by the coast or by inland rivers. We know what's, and the reason for this is that nuclear needs very significant cooling for the reactors and for the spent fuel and spent fuel ponds. So it needs to take lots of water to cool these very hot uh, systems. And so therefore it's cited by the coast or by inland rivers or lakes. Now the problem is, we know the problem is, and we can look at the models, what will happen to our coasts, but more importantly, there's a thing called storm surge, which is basically when certain atmospheric conditions meet high tide, the sea basically ups and moves in land. And you, could, you can credibly predict that the majority of the current and potentially future nuclear plants by the coast will be at significant flood risk from storm surge driven climate uh, driven uh, sea level rise driven uh, flooding. In land, they have different problems. Like in France, France has started to shut it down nuclear uh, during the summer because the rivers become too hot or too low flow. And at the moment, the question is, um, it's slightly more complex than sort of actually taking in the, the heated water. The French nuclear uh, was not allowed to discharge this heated water that it used to cool down the reactors and spent fuel point because basically it would kill the receiving uh, river waters. So basically, uh, at the end of the day, you can comfortably predict that both coastal and inland nuclear will be significant climate casualties. So even if the discussion is, oh, well, nuclear will save us from climate, by the, the simple facts of, of the matter, that, that's not the case. But perhaps, you know, people are more concerned about money these days than, than other kinds of issues. The key issue about nuclear is that it's not only, uh, it's, it's very, very costly. So therefore there's things called, uh, there's this, uh, so if you spend all this money on nuclear, you won't be able to spend the money on things that we know we can do here and now. And also the other key thing about nuclear is it's very late. Now, the UK government uh, published a report a couple of years ago, uh, which is, uh, you know, good research, which states quite clearly that on average, new nuclear takes up to 17 years 